If you think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County, then think again. Always stay connected to NCTV45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are Newswatch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV45, anytime on your time. Entrusting your loved one to a funeral director is a very personal and emotional decision. The funeral director you choose must understand the importance of the decision you have made. When you call the William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, I recognize what a privilege it is to be chosen at your time of need. We will provide you and your family with the best service possible, with sincerity and compassion. The William and Roger DiCarbo Funeral Home, family owned and operated since 1941. NC TV 45 Newcastle, The Train. But yes, it's a community sing along, karaoke, if you will. Where? At the Majestic Castleton. Yes, uh, if you haven't seen the Majestic Castleton, it is fixed up and looks excellent right there on Mercer Street. So, um, they're going to have this event from 6 to 8, Saturday, January 19th, which is tomorrow, okay, uh, Saturday the 19th. I don't want to say tomorrow, because if you're watching any time on your time, you'll get all mixed up. So, uh, go over and enjoy the sing-along, and it should be a great time. We're going to take this break. We'll hear from these sponsors and be right back. At our law firm, we see you. Come see us at lgkg.com. NC TV 45 Newcastle, The Train. Today's program was provided through funding from Coney Island, Coney Island downtown in downtown Newcastle, a Newcastle tradition. Rolls on. Chancellor Daniel Greenstein is welcome to the PASSHE, and that's the Pennsylvania State system of higher education. Making a new vision for the 14 public universities, Governor Tom Wolf today celebrated the swearing-in of Daniel Greenstein as the fifth chancellor of Pennsylvania's state, higher, state system of higher education. Greenstein is a former leader with uh, Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and the University of California system. Dr. Greenstein comes from the state system at a time of tremendous challenge and tremendous opportunity, says Governor Wolf. I am proud to uh, participate in the selection of Dan as the new chancellor, and I welcome the opportunity to work with him and uh, a new vision of our public universities. We are a strong state system that provides every student with affordable education so they can succeed in Pennsylvania. Now, uh, we're going to take this break, and uh, congratulations as we roll on with Newswatch. We'll be right back. NC TV 45 Newcastle, The Train. Parkstown Restaurant has been serving the greater Newcastle area with quality and experience in family dining and great entertainment. The Parkstown Restaurant located at 2800 West State Street, Newcastle. Eat in or take out. All These fine businesses provided funding for this program. Gatherings, 
Town and Country, and On Target. And we're back. Governor Wolf uh, makes nominations for second term appointments. Today, Governor Wolf put forth the following nominations, to name a few. Jessica Altman, uh, Secretary of Insurance. Kathy Brokvar, Secretary of Commonwealth. Major General Anthony uh, Caretti, Adjunct General and Department of Military Affairs. And uh, I'm just going to give the uh, bridge list. Uh, the following appointments have already been made. And uh, so he's putting together his cabinet. So uh, good luck to all as uh, they embark on governor's second term. We're going to take this break on Newswatch. Hear from these great sponsors who keep community television on the air. program was provided through funding from Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Cedars featuring Middle Eastern, Italian, and American cuisine. Yeah, you got it. The Cedar Sports Corner Report. And uh, since it seems it's going to be a little snowy, here's some games for you to view. Head over to Cedars, get some great view, food, and enjoy the games. Memphis, in the NBA, in the NBA Memphis is at the Celtics. The Heat's at the Pistons. That's at the Magic Spurs. They're at the Timberwolves while the Cavs take on the Jazz. Now, if hockey's your game, the Pens are at the Coyotes, the Canadians, why they're at the Blue Jackets, and in NBA basketball, Maryland takes on Ohio State, St. Joe's takes on St. Louis, Xavier, they're at Villanova, and Northwestern, they're taking on Rutgers. Now, that was the Cedar Sports Quarter Report. Enjoy the games. Enjoy the great food at Cedars. We're going to take a timeout. We'll be right back.
NC TV 45 Newcastle The Train Today's program furnished by funding from Bill's Bake Shop where smiles are everywhere. This program furnished by a grant from Ferone Brothers. Two locations, Newcastle on Mill Street and Wilmington Road in Newcastle. This program furnished by a grant from Keystone Specialty, Newcastle's party store on Mill Street in Newcastle. Well, folks, and every December, we ask you to vote for the River of the Year. Well, by golly, you did that. As I get another pen, because mine went bye-byes. Uh, and guess what the River of the Year is? The Clarion River. Yes, the Clarion River was named River of the Year with public voting. The wild and scenic that draws legends of ang legions of anglers and uh, paddlers to the great outdoors throughout the season. The Clarion River in northwest Pennsylvania, I would haul it, hardly call it northwest, has been voted the state's 2019 River of the Year. And congratulations to all the fish that are in school or have travel in schools in the Clarion River because you're in the river of the year. <laughs> I can't help it. It just is a silly thing, but we have a river of the year and it's Clarion. Congratulations. We'll be right back. NC TV 45 Newcastle The Train This program was provided through funding from Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Cedars featuring Middle Eastern, Italian, and American cuisine. A special thanks to the YMCA for caring about the Lawrence County community and providing funding for this program. A special thank you to Tuscany Square Restaurant, Wilmington and Mitchell Roads for providing funding for this program. A familiar story on Newsbox. Watch, it's the Gutchies for Kids. Now, why they chose that name, I have no idea. But we did this last year. It's a quota. The International Club of Hermitage was uh, introduced to Newcastle by the president, Connie Michaels Connerly, Connerly Cleaners. And uh, she stated that items such as underwear, socks, pajamas, and long underwear for children in our area. The United Way has been working with many uh, families uh, with various such homelessness. Uh, these items are very much needed for the winter months. Gutchies. Western Pennsylvania slang for underwear and many of us grew up with the terminology I didn't but uh, the term is distributed the, the items are distributed by the IU4 office Wendy Kiner regional coordinator for homeless uh, and foster care children in our area Wendy says the children are uh, coming from various homes, inadequate clothes. They need, unfortunately, they need uh, to keep this to keep growing. The Newcastle Area School District understands the need for the collection 
according to Brian Rice, social worker at Lockley Elementary. Brian identifies Wendy Kiner uh, that most of all the children are in need of basic clothes such as underwear, socks, t-shirts, and long underwear. Now, I guess if you have any questions, call 724-658-8528. If you want to donate or something, they can uh, help you uh, with where to drop off those gotchies. Now, we'll be right back after we hear from these great sponsors. Tuscany Square Restaurant, 3470 Wilmington Road, where old world charm meets the modern conveniences of today. Spacious seating and amenities await. Fresh ingredients that make that just right pizza or entree. It's Tuscany Square for your next event. Stop and see us or give us a call at 724-654-0365. Hello and welcome to Lawrence County 45 weather. Well, after last night's Standing cloudy low of 33 and drizzle, and, and that's kind of like the good news because we missed a major snow type event that night. Now, we've got a few more nights to go, so let's not celebrate too much. How's your Friday looking? Well, when you look at local radar, pretty clear locally off to the northeast, you see some disturbance. But on the national scene out to the west is the story. Well, your Friday, partly uh, cloudy, some fog, high of 33, you're going to get patchy drizzle, and it's just going to be miserable. Now, Friday night, cloudy, low around 25. And then we bop into Saturday. Snow after 8, high of 30. Chance of snow 100%, and you're looking at 3 to 5 inches. Snow Saturday night with a low of 15. Chance of snow 80%. Sunday, mostly cloudy, 16. And uh, it will be cold. Sunday night, mostly cloudy, low around 2. Temperature keeps going down, and then you get to Martin Luther King. A lot of people off. Partly sunny, a high at 12. Monday night, partly cloudy, a low at 2. And then Tuesday, snow showers arrive on the scene. Mostly cloudy, 34. Chance of snow flurries, 30%. Now, Tuesday night, rain and snow. Mix, cloudy, low of 28. Chance of precip is 60%. You get a rain-snow mix on Wednesday. Cloudy, 39. Chance of precip is 60%. And Wednesday night, rain-snow mix, mostly cloudy, 23. Chance of precip is 50%. You bop into Thursday. Snow showers, mostly cloudy, and 31. Chance of precip is 40%. Now, uh, just an ugly type time. <laughs> but it's winter in western Pennsylvania. What are you going to say? That was Lawrence County 45 weather. And we're going to take this break here from these great sponsors. And Standing we'll be right back. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. NCTV 45, Newcastle, the train.
This program furnished by the MAD Unit, Mobile Auto Detailing, C. Michael Sad at themadunit.com. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Funding for this program furnished by Mary Turner's Day Spa, Wilmington Road, Neshanic Township, Newcastle. Keeping you informed, Pennsylvania provides the first ever dedicated computer science funding to 765 schools. Building on the commitment to prepare students to use computers and technology in their careers, Governor Tom Wolf announced the $8.7 million in targeted grants to expand computer science classes and teach training of 765 schools across the Commonwealth. The targeted grants represent the next phase of the governor's new innovative PA Smart Initiative which will provide $20 million to bring high-quality computer science and STEM education in elementary, middle, and high schools and professional development to teachers with this commitment. Pennsylvania now ranks second in the country for investments in K, STEM, and computer science. So uh, can't say enough about that. Got to get prepared for a whole new age. We're going to take this break, hear from these great sponsors who keep community television on the air. There's more than me. NCTV 45, the train, anytime on your time. Welcome back, and uh, we hope you've enjoyed uh, NCTV 45's News Watch nightly. We attempt to bring you news and views and stuff that is going on that probably affects you that you might miss from one day to the next. And as you're sitting around tonight, make sure you tell a friend about NCTV 45. They'll be glad you did. And by all means, get a second cup of coffee and maybe another piece of pie. And have a pleasant evening in what I call the greatest castle in the world, in the county of Lawrence. Have a great evening, everybody, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Got my ticket for the midnight plane, and it's not easy.